The Frog and the Ox One day, a little frog came hopping up to a big frog, who was sitting by the pond. The little frog looked really excited. What happened? asked the big frog. Oh, father, I have seen the biggest frog in the world, said the little frog. It was as big as a mountain. It had horns on its head, a long tail, and its nose was divided into two. Ha! said the big frog. Tush, child, tush. You must have seen the farmer's ox. But the big frog wasn't willing to accept that the ox was greater than him, so he said, But I don't think it's bigger than me. He may be a little taller than me, but you see, I can easily make myself as big as he is. Huh? Can you show me? asked the little frog. Hmm, said the big frog. Was he as big as this? as he puffed himself up. Oh, much bigger than that, said the little frog. Then the big frog puffed himself up again and asked, Was he this big? Much, much bigger than you. Again, the big frog blew himself out and asked the young one if the ox was as big as that. Bigger, father, bigger, was the reply. Ridiculous, said the big frog, who thought he was much more important than he actually was. Wait, and I'll show you. I'm the oldest frog in this pond, and the biggest, too. So the big frog took a deep breath, and blew, and blew, and blew, and swelled, and swelled, and swelled. Stop it, father, said the little frog. I think you're going to hurt yourself. But pride overtook the big frog, and he kept blowing himself out. He puffed and puffed himself so much, and he finally burst. Boom! The big frog had lost his life just because he wasn't ready to let go of his pride. <laughs> Hi friends! Did you have a lot of fun with the videos? Do you want more? Subscribe to our channel to have more fun with me! Click here to continue watching more such beautiful sing-song rhymes.